Tracy, welcome back to my channel. I'm so glad you're here. And today I wanted to talk about some wonderful additions to my skincare routine. And um, I'd felt something was missing for quite a while and I wanted to add some things in, and in particular, peptides and ceramides. I have actually found some natural-based, cruelty-free, um, and affordable products to um, add the peptides and the ceramides in. So the peptide moisturizer that I am using is the Derma E Skin Restore um, Collagen Peptide and Collagen Moisturizer. And um, it's really affordable. It was about $15 on Ulta. I have seen it for more than that, but I think Ulta has about the best price on it that I have seen. And it has, it's a combination of peptides, which help re rebuild the skin and um, soften wrinkles, um, Arjuline, um, which prevents the formation of expression wrinkles by softening and um, inhibiting the muscle movement and they call it Botox in a bottle but it's not quite like Botox but um, it has been proven to reduce wrinkles also it, it has um, the pycnogenol in it which is an amazing antioxidant that supports healthy collagen and you know healthy collagen helps to rebuild the skin and um, smooth out wrinkles plump up the skin vitamin C green tea for ex extra antioxidants. Um, the Advanced Collagen and Peptides Moisturizer instantly hydrates while creating a renewed radiant complexion. That comes from the box actually. And it also says it hydrates skin so it looks plump and feels supple, improves the appearance of the skin's tone and texture. So I can tell you that I've been wanting to use peptides for quite a while but I've been doing research and I don't have a huge beauty budget at the moment. Um, so when I buy something, I really want to make sure and do a lot of research and, and look at reviews and make sure something is working for other people. And this had glowing reviews. So I can, I can tell you that I've used it for about only about five days. I'll be doing an update on it, you know, uh, later on, maybe in a couple months. But um, in just five days, I've noticed that my skin has taken on a more smoother appearance. So I'm really, really excited about this one right here. Another product that I have been using, um, it has um, ceramides in it. And I just wanted to say, years and years ago, um, in the early 90s, I worked for Elizabeth Arden. I was a counter girl and a beauty advisor. And we were probably the only company that had ceramides in their products. And um, nobody really even knew what they were. But um, but at the time, we were, we were it. So... Um, I was pleased though because I've seen ceramides in, in the CeraVe um, product. It seems like everybody is using a lot of those products and they really like them and I've been wanting to buy them but the only thing about CeraVe is it's not completely a clean product so I looked for a clean, um, a clean product with ceramides and I was able to find one so I'm really excited because this, um, this is Ceramedics. And it actually is made by a company called Earth Science. Earth Science makes um, clean products, cruelty-free um, products, and um, they have another um, line. It is a moisturizer. This is a, I think a body moisturizer and a cleanser. And then this is um, actually the moisturizer. And see how huge this is? It's like what? Uh, this is about six ounce, six ounces actually. So it's huge, it's gonna last forever. And you know what, it was like $14.99. I bought this at my local natural food store. But anyway, so natural ceramide technology can actually help improve and heal dryness. It improves moisture retention and prevents dryness from recurring. And um, this product is formulated actually without irritating parabens, fragrances, um, petrolatum, and um, it's free of all that, and so it's a natural-based product again, and has been clinically tested to ensure it is gentle enough for actually for sensitive skin, and it's been fine on my skin so far. Um, I wanna say that in skincare products, ceramides are used to replenish the natural lipids that are lost from exposure to harsh environmental factors, and when you use drying products such as a lot of maybe 
um, retin-a or a lot of exfoliation your skin might dry out you might end up um, you might end up damaging your barrier this helps to restore the barrier of the skin I would say with this okay this is at first when you apply this on your skin it's it's going to not feel um, like a normal moisturizer it's going to feel a little bit i don't want to say dry but not quite as moist but once you put it in after a couple minutes then it then it it'll feel more moist after you've had it on for a couple minutes so um i've i've been using this for about a week and i i really love it i'm really excited this one's at night this one is in the morning and at night what I wanted to mention too, uh, along with the peptides and the ceramides, I have, I I use rose hip seed oil, and I have a video on different types of retinols that are available that I will link below, and I have been looking into other retinols, and I decided to go with the ordinary 0.5 in Squaw Lane for now, and I'm just going to go ahead and add that to my rose hip seed oil just maybe just a little bit and mix it in, just to boost the rose hip seed oil because I think the rose hip seed oil does great on its own, but I think I want something a little bit more active at this point. So I'm gonna be using this, this with the rose hip seed oil. They have a different um, strengths in, from the ordinary. I think they have a 1% as well. So this is, this is a fairly gentle retinol and um, so I'm, I'm thinking it'll go well with the rose hip seed oil. So that's basically it. These are my wonderful additions to my skincare routine. And I will be reporting back in a couple months just to let you know how it's going. And maybe I will be doing another um, morning routine and just explaining how I use, how I use all these and um, demonstrating it as well. Anyway, thank you so much for watching. I really appreciate it. And I hope your summer is going great. And um, I will see you again soon. Bye-bye.